Hello again. Well, if you've created a spot mix earlier and now you've finished using it, you'll probably want the easiest way to clean it for use again at a later date. And there's a good chance you've got a fair bit of caked on but uncured mortar like this. The first place I like to start is with a bricklayer's trowel or similar dull bladed object. It allows me to get into all the nooks and crannies very easily without scraping it and creating damage. And because the mortar hasn't been allowed to cure on the spot for any great length of time it ships off easily. Obviously if you're scraping any sort of cement or dust like this wear a mask and try to work upwind. Once all the main solids are loose tip them into a bucket for disposal with all the other old mortar. This can then be disposed of as hardcore. Next I give the shovel a light hammering straight into the same bucket and because it's neither wet or cured on the old compo simply chips off a treat. No need for water or scrubbing. Now it's time to give the spot a quick bath. There's no need to go crazy with the water. Two to three pints is more than adequate. One of the benefits of a spot mix over a cement mixer is how easy it is to clean afterwards and how little water you actually need. Using a stiff bristle brush just wash the water around the spot and any of the last bits of surface mortar simply lift off or become so diluted that they lose all strength. And because we didn't use much water the spot can be simply lifted into the air and drained into a spare bucket. Pro tip. Any cemented water can now be simply disposed of over the neighbour's fence, into a plant pot, down a drain in the street or under the nearest bush, just like a pro. Now your spot is clean, you can hang it on a wall until you need it again and it will last you a very long time over many projects. Oh, that brings another video to an end. Thanks for watching.